this year, 2023, we decided to make a project in a scale which we have never done before. So we decided to bring together quantum physics with music and visual arts. The result was the interdisciplinary project Tangly Entangled. This is a work that must be experienced um, in space because it talks about different quantum physics phenomena by means of video art and sound. Quantum physics is full of analogies and that's the beauty of it. And I find there is also a poetic side to quantum physics, which is very inspiring and it opens up uh, uh, artistic imagination. Noise is a difficult enemy to fight. But if we want to unlock the full power of quantum computation, it is essential we defeat the enemy and achieve quantum coherence. As a physicist, it's my first time collaborating with professional artists. I was really impressed with how the musicians and the composer, Linda Lehmanner, were able to take complex quantum mechanical ideas and turn it into something the audience could experience. I have to admit, at first I was a little skeptical how the concepts of quantum mechanics could be translated into music. But at some point we had a finished script for the physicists and I really was excited to see where all this would go. And then I started to hear the music, I saw the visuals, we got into the museum and I realized just how much of an immersive experience this would be for the audience. The whole concept was to put something so abstract as quantum physics as a quantum computer into something which is tangible for a broad audience which has nothing to do with quantum physics in their daily life. We were thinking, for example, how could we depict entanglement in musical terms? So we came up with the idea of having, for example, two flutists separating each other in a room, slowly, while playing the same rhythm or tune. And even if they couldn't hear each other or see each other anymore, because the distance in this room would kind of symbolize the distance of the universe, they would still be able to play in the same rhythm and harmony. This is how we try to, for example, depict entanglement. I think it's great that the Swiss National Competence Center, NCCR SPIN, supported such a novel outreach event. It was certainly a risk, but the reaction of the public has been overwhelming, and so it was really all worth it. After the concert finished, the people jumped up in standing positions. For me, as a festival director, it was very exciting to see how this big project came together after so many months of work. It could have gone either way. When we first conceived this piece, we didn't know what we were getting into. There were no blueprints on how to make a project like this happen. Nothing has existed like this before. And judging from the feedback of the audience, from people, from the media, we feel very encouraged to continue our journey in creating projects like Tangly Entangled. At some point, we will harness the immense power of the quantum world. And when we do that, well, when we do that, the possibilities are infinite.